So um, we're here today to discuss uh, if we had sense, which sense we would lose. <laughs> well, I have lots of senses already. Yeah. That's not the hypothetical. But if we'll, you, we'll if you had to lose one of your five senses, yeah. what would you lose, Oliver? It's quite difficult. It's hard imagining yourself without all your senses. I probably lose my sense of fashion. This is a G, please. I don't really want to lose any of my senses. Because... Neither do I. I'm assuming this is the question like, you have no choice in the matter. You have to lose one of your senses. Just touch and feel because I wouldn't want to lose my sight because then I couldn't draw. There are some blind artists I know. Um, and if I couldn't hear, then I couldn't listen to music and that couldn't give me inspiration to draw. Um, Probably my sight, because it's something I can live without, whereas my taste, my smell, my hearing, my touch, I need to be a, I need to have it all. So yeah, I mean, taste, pizza, yummy. Then of course there's the fact that I need to be able to hear because I'm a musician. And yeah, that's all I really got, so... Off. I don't need my sense of smell. That's... That, that could be a possibility, not to give that up, because... Like, it's not, you don't need it, it's not a priority, it doesn't do anything, but it's related to memory. Well, you perceive your whole world through your senses, once you lose one of them, part of that perception is gone, you know? If you lose your sense of smell, suddenly that whole sense of what the air's like in an area, you, you can't get that. And my sense of taste, no way I would ever be able to give that up in the entire world, it's my favourite. I love food to pieces. I love it more than my mum. And I could actually consider it as a love of my life so far. So far, that is. I don't eat food because I'm hungry. I eat food because it tastes good. And I like the way it feels in my stomach. I love food to pieces. Never would I give up that sense. I could say losing eyesight because I already can't really see very well but I kind of like the amount of sight I've got there's pros and cons I guess um, maybe sense of smell because smelling icky things is icky mm. if you can't smell you can't taste is that but, true? Really? yes <laughs> oh no I love my food too much Okay, if I had to live without one sense, I'd have to say it would be taste. A couple of reasons this. First of all, I'd probably survive much better with um, my particular style of cooking. But if I lost my touch, then I wouldn't know if I was holding the pencil or not, or if I was typing on the keyboard or anything like that. Um, also, I reckon... But it would be pretty cool because then I could give high fives to people as hard as I possibly could and then I wouldn't be able to feel it and they'd be like, oh my god, my head hurts so hard and then I'll be like, whatever. I mean, what if I touched something, like if I was eating like a hamburger or something and it was actually stale, I wouldn't really be able to tell. If I had to pick one to lose, I said, yeah. Hmm. Look, it's my forehead. Uh. And there's like a drop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a fish. Oh, 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 oh. Help me. <laughs> Help me. I'm stretching out of my shell. I'm shelf. a thumb. I'm a thumb. Down. Mm. Sense of taste. Because it's more the texture with foods with me. Mm. A good textured food is nice. Wait, so you'd lose that? Yeah. <laughs> Sense of taste. Yep. Mm. Like the feel of a grain of salt is much better than its taste. Yep. I don't know, it's kind of nice not being able to taste the food that you eat. It'd be interesting, actually. 